bạn các bạn Ok, had my coffee. So last night you were, where did you sleep last night? City Motel. City Motel? And who paid for that? I'm not certain he did. Did you say it was AIDS New Brunswick? I, I don't know that for a fact. Okay. AIDS AIDS. Don't know. Maybe. No social worker taught to you? Mm, I talked to uh, my case manager yes, uh, yesterday. What did she say? Uh, to he and... Uh, hey, he. He's going to coordinate with uh, the clinic here to uh, try and have me like fast track into... Hey, Jerry. Hello. Fast track into some housing. But... Uh, Someone asked me if I would be interested in a group home, which I'm, I'm not. Like people like you can't live with other people. I can live with other people. I just uh, I I always seem to be uh, well. I I, I guess I move, march to the beat of my own drum and. Sometimes it's not always right for everyone else, and and sometimes it, you know just whatever else is going around around isn't right for me. And uh, just like me, I couldn't live with, with other people. I mean, I, yeah, I do like my my privacy, and I I do like living alone, like. Uh, I mean, I don't like being lonely, but uh, I, I don't, it's not important to me to have people like around me constantly or... I never see you hang around with the group downtown. You don't. You're a loner. Mm -hmm. And I'm, I'm worried about the housing that sometimes the social worker involved with the housing will hold it over your head to and usually it's, it's stuff that's supposed to be you know beneficial for you or you know there's a good reason for it. but I don't always respond well to when I'm being told I have to do no. and, and certain things like I, I'm I'll, I'll definitely work with them, I, but there's other things like. So where are you gonna sleep tonight? Well, probably uh, in a bank vestibule, I guess. Or you know, it, it's when night comes and it's just uh, step by step, like like that. It's. Uh, Wherever the day takes you. How did you go at the city motel last night? I got on the bus. Did somebody give you a, a donation? Is that from the government? Yes. Oh, the government gave you 20 bucks? He <laughs> gave me $452. A what? $452. You got $452? Yes. From where? From the government. For what? Welfare. Really? So, uh... That, that's just my monthly... My yeah. Monthly, you know. Do you have it in the bank account, or...? Never mind, I don't want to know that. So, you turn tonight, you, you're going to sleep in the bank? Pro probably, that's where I usually one of them, if, if I can stay in there long enough. But I, I understand why they don't want people in there, and I understand why sometimes, if other people start doing it, you know, I understand that. So they give you the city motel just for one night? Yeah. Usually, uh, I know the John Howards and the Salvation Army do it. They usually will put someone up, like, if they're close to housing, 
Like they know they're going to be have housing soon, or maybe maybe if they have some sort of injury or something. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so what? This is part four. My God, uh, there's a lot of. Uh, well, we're just going to keep be... on do, doing a follow up. You want the dog to walk around with, or travel, or push around with? <laughs> <laughs> He'll push you. He'll yeah, push you around. Pull me, pull me. I was thinking that you get a, a dog to pull me on my my wheelchair or a goat. That'll be a good service dog for you. Mm -hmm. Good luck. He's smart. <laughs>